so hi all so today we'll discuss about the rf optimization ericsson system kpi slavers and its roadmap especially this course is designed for rf engineer drive test engineer or rna radio network optimizer those who are working in third party companies or also this course is designed those are working in another system like Hawaii, Jetty, Nokia and those who wants to migrate in Ericsson system so you will learn the Ericsson system right now in market there is such opening for a less experienced candidate Ericsson is hiring more number they are offering good salary package and uh, also after this course you will get uh, at least 5 to 10 lakh per annum job so let's see content so mostly the table of contact will discuss first LT basics in LT basics we'll discuss more about the next slides and uh, another second things 5g basics volte basics and also we'll discuss vonr so both are similar but technology will be change only like 4g in volte and 5g in vonr then we'll discuss in fourth counter level optimization how counter looks like how we can identify which counter for which kpi now fifth we'll discuss parameter tuning like which parameter we have to change for the kpi improvement like there is a dcr drop call there is volte call drop so in that case which parameter we have to change to minimize the call drop so that our kpi will be more efficient the sixth one will discuss Ericsson features. In the next slide will discuss about the features and all in deep. In LT basics, first we'll discuss LT architecture. In LT architecture, lots of nodes. We'll discuss node functionality end to end. We'll discuss LT call flow. In LT call flow, in interviewer they will ask LT call flow, 5G call flow, Volte call flow, VNR call flow. So every call flow will discuss in detail over the tool, like we'll discuss later. And layer three analysis. Suppose the drive test happened in a cluster, lots of there is lots of uh, sites and a cluster suppose 30 sites or 40 sites so in which site having different different rsrp rsrq sign r and many more things so if a call drop happened or less throughput happened bad sign r so in that case we have to check cell wise analysis so we'll check uh, nas and rrc related things so we will we'll use one tool for the call flow we will show like this one so this is the tool where you will get all the information all the messages what is the meaning of MIV what is the meaning of RRC connection request like message so by this tool we'll discuss about the call flow so that you will never forget the call flow part so similar like 4G will discuss in Volte call, VNR call and 5G call as well. So after call flow we'll discuss LT KPI. LT KPI like accessibility, retainability, mobility and uh, throughput. In for example in LT we'll discuss the in accessibility, we'll discuss about the RRC connection setup success rate. 
S1 set of success rate and RAP set of success rate. So everything we'll discuss in to detail. Then we'll discuss counters. Which counter for which KPI and categories. So everything we'll discuss in to the detail. After counter discussion, we need to change the parameters. So also discuss parameters like which parameter is for which API like this one from the Excel like this parameter will discuss into the detail for accessibility retainability mobility so everything will well well designed manner then after parameter we'll discuss soft optimization process suppose you are working from India and uh, you are working for US operators or or like uh, Bangkok like operators DTEC and operator like in Vietnam VNM mobile and uh, you are working from remotely so in our RF optimization engineer are working for the KPI optimization or OSS or drive test based KPI optimization so they will recommend a CR change request so they will log in the site and check the parameters like what is the tilt what is the power what is the how many users on edge on different different bands and how to check the alarms and everything will discuss in the detail and that they will raise a CR chain request so rent team will change the parameter so after changing the parameter will check the pre and post what are the impact on uh, after the changing the parameters so like soft optimization process we'll discuss end to end then we'll discuss how to use mycom mycom is a re reporting tool where we can fetch the report on hourly day wise or or last seven days or maybe 30 days or it's a depend on scenario to scenario also, we'll discuss how to log in sites. How to log in the site through ENM or OSS. What is the command to log in the site? How to check alarms and which command is for which activity? So, everything we'll discuss in total detail. How to do troubleshooting into the tool. So, everything we'll discuss in the detail. Also, we'll discuss real time case analysis so that will be you will be more confident toward the learning and also if real time example or real time case study you will get so also you will you will get the help in the interview and because the interviewer they will ask a question based on case studies so it helps to give the answer so it's moved from the next slide So next topic is 5G basics. You know, in last uh, two three years, the deployment happened on the ground. So operator is looking 5G optimization engineer, but in industry there is no much 5G expert. So this is a good chance you can learn and you can work into this domain. So in 5G, we'll discuss deployment option in 5G. Option 1, 2, 3, or 3x, three 4, 5, like this. We'll discuss into the detail why 5G comes, 5G key feature. We'll discuss and uh, we'll discuss what is the non standalone and what is the standalone model description about the 5G. Then we'll discuss into the detail 5G node functionality. Then we'll discuss into the detail the 5G NSA call flow, SA call flow because in interviewer they will ask about the call flow. If you know the call flow, you will analyze the layer 3 messages step by step. So call flow is must also in an interviewer they will ask about the call flow like 4G, 5G, Volt, WNR, SA, NSA, CSFB call flow, SRVCC call flow. So you will get here then we'll discuss 5g kpi similar kpi like in 4g accessibility retainability looks into the excel 
like in 4G accessibility, returnability, mobility, load balancing, throughput and everything will discuss into the detail. So similar like LTE KPI and also 5G KPI. So we'll discuss both into the detail. So after discussion of KPI, we'll discuss 5G counters, for which counter we have to check for which KPI. After checking the KPI, we have to optimize the site for 5G parameters. So 5G parameter is separate. So we'll discuss like this one. ENDC, the KPI alarms and everything, which parameter like this, and which commands and everything we'll discuss about the like this counter. There's a parameter we are changing like things. So everything will discuss into the detail. So after 5G parameters, we'll discuss case analysis like accessibility, what will 5 to 6 case and accessibility and retainability 5 to 6 case study for throughput as well and mobility. So everything we'll discuss into the detail. After 5G, we'll discuss Bolti basics and VONR basic. Volti call flow, VONR call flow. We'll use tool for Volti call flow and VONR call flow so that will be more efficient for you. Then we'll discuss about the Volti KPI like DCR, Volti parameters and counters and this related to case study. Also will relate similar to Volti and VONR. So next will next slide. So we'll discuss in detail counter level optimization. We'll discuss Ericsson counter description based on counter parameter optimization. Then post CR, then pre and post analysis while raising the CR after implementation will check pre and post analysis so that we can verify our after changing the parameters improvement happened into the network <clears throat> then parameter tuning soft parameter optimization process will discuss based on actual case study so that will be help for you to learn in four better way also this course is for hindi and english both the medium so don't worry if you do shy about the uh, difficult to learn in english so we are open to use both hindi and english word but we'll mostly follow the english word because it then in interview they will ask the question in english and the mostly uh, in remote work you will get customer right out of india in india they will ask not much in english but english is the good language for the learning to work in a professional engineers like then move in <clears throat> then we'll discuss ericsson features like automation anr features efficient drx interfrequency load balancing interfrequency lt and over data forwarding at intra lt and over then we'll discuss mobility control at poor coverage mcpc multiple radio bearer per user pci conflict reporting then we'll discuss pdcch power boost maximum cell range ca lms mlv anr csfb srvc and many more things lots of feature in ericsson so we'll discuss into the detail like in design in one excel like 4g basic intelligence connectivity lt fbtdd capability aware ideal mode control ntd and fdd enhanced pdc link adaptation carrier aggregation dynamic cell selection for carrier aggregation 5c 4c endc trigger handover during setup when this discuss in the 5g para features like LTNR downlink aggregation, LTNR uplink aggregation, massive MIMO, mid-BIM band 
explore made two way active measurement protocol initiate a downlink multi mimo mid band so everything will discuss into the detail also we'll discuss how to logging the site how to check the alarm how to check the parameter how to check the cell priority how to check the csfb srvcc how to check the alarm how to change the electrical tilt how to check and how to change the parameters so everything will discuss into the detail this type of learning nobody is providing across the world and also we'll discuss about the mycom the reporting tool counter level cell level site level cluster level network level so everything will discuss into the detail so don't worry about this and after completion of course we'll provide some bonus question so uh, interview question discussion cb preparation main thing is cb preparation preparation you, you know everything but you what you have to mention in your resume will guide how to make your resume so that in one shot go, go your resume will be shortlisted so everything will guide and uh, this upcoming batch will be 142 number batch we are running batches from last 15 years so it's a time for you if you are working in less pay or third parties company where you are getting salary after two months and uh, so this is the course well designed 4g 5g volt and vnr also also we'll discuss the cluster cluster report to how to we can optimize the clusters so everything will discuss into the detail also we have designed question answer also you can check so this type of question answer you will get the complete 4g and complete 5g the 5g questions so everything you will get with ATS after completion of course we'll try to provide selection and uh, minimum two interviews will conduct with our references and uh, no no limit for well prepared candidate our motto is selection only if you join with arab tech solutions i need your selection and uh, this course duration for weekdays is 1.5 month <coughs> almost i need 35 hours to complete the thing and a weekdays batch 9 pm to 10 pm so those who are looking to change in your life and the doing job in this industry to upgrade yourself this course is faster to change your life so thanks for watching our video For more detail, you can connect with our team with the below numbers. Our official website is www.araptechsolutions.in. Uh, you can mail us official at the rate araptechsolutions.in. And we are ATS from Maharashtra. So see you soon. Thanks again for watching this video